in this video i'll explain to you the gallery application of the meizu m2 which is running on flyme os 4.5.3 i which is the indian version of the os and i'll explain to you the gallery application and all its functionality in detail so uh, this is how the gallery application looks like and uh, here you'll find two tabs that is photo and gallery so first we'll take a look at the gallery tab and you can select it from the top and here you will find all the folders of the images that you have and they have been sorted uh, in this way that whenever you record a video it goes in, into the recording folder the screenshot goes into the screenshot folders if you download some images from facebook they go to the facebook folder and uh, it goes like that so uh, if you don't find any image in the gallery tab what you got to do is click on this plus icon on the bottom of the gallery tab and here you'll find all the different folders that you would like to add to this gallery tab and uh, they'll show up in the gallery tab here so as you can see I just added this folder here and it has come up so this is how the gallery tab functions and uh, we'll try to open an image from here and first let me show you I have opened this images folder here and there are these three dots on the bottom so uh, in that you can choose to sort it sort these images by name or start a slideshow so you can even sli start a slideshow of a particular folder and uh, let me open an image here and as you can see here I have opened this image on the top right side you will find this eye icon and on the left side on the top you find the uh, month of the folder so that is November uh, was the month when this image was uh, recorded or downloaded so when you click on this eye icon you will find the file name and the extension size path and uh, modification time so you can actually rename this file from here and uh, even resize it according to your needs and click on the save tab save button on the bottom and the images image it image get edited so the other functions here in the gallery application are when you open this image you get these four buttons on the bottom on the left most side there is this uh, button where you can add filters to this image so you can add different filters and uh, you can even touch this image here and you can compare it with the previous one so you can try it out in your phones and uh, let's go back so uh, the other tab on the bottom is for sharing so you can share this image in all the applications that can be used for video photo sharing and the other tab here is for delete and the last one that is the three dots are for they are the settings or options menu where you can where you have the mark crop rotate or set as wallpaper option so when you click on mark uh, this is what you get you can uh, add some text or color or some stuff like that you've got this brush shape text mosaic eraser color etc and you can uh, undo and redo from here and you can share or save this image so let's go back and check out a uh, crop option so this is how you can crop the image and uh, you can do it freely uh, by clicking on if you have selected this first tab on the bottom here or you can uh, use this pre-selected uh, ratios aspect ratios 1 is to 1 3 is to 2 etc or you can even customize it or you can go back so uh, the other option and these three dots are to rotate this image and uh, you can rotate it clockwise or anti-clockwise or you can even make a mirror of this image and you can click on save and the image gets saved that way and the last is set as wallpaper so it will ask you to zoom in and uh, by clicking on this you can uh, preview this image and then you can set it so uh, let's quickly go back now and you have studied this uh, gallery tab in detail so let's check out this photo tab so in this photo tab you will get all the images sorted in folders uh, like January uh, December November October actually I did not have this phone in January but uh, 
the, when I got the phone, I took these two images and the images got saved in the January folder as the time and date were not set. So it is not a fault of the phone, it was my, for my fault. And uh, the same happens in these images also, you can check the information etc. So uh, this is how the folders are sorted here. And there are two tabs on the bottom in the photo tab. The first one is to sort the images by uh, location and the second one is to sort it by time and date. So you can, uh, if you have not selected location while taking photos, so all the images are getting collected in a single folder. And But I have set the date and time so the photos are getting divided or separated in the respected folders and the other option is to start a slideshow so this way you can start a slideshow you can pause it or you can shuffle it so you can keep it on shuffle or you can just uh, play uh, let the slideshow play the images uh, in the ascending order so that is that's it that that is it guys so thank you so much for uh, your time and thank you so much for watching